close your eyes. Focus on your breath. Allow your breath to drop you into a deep place within yourself. Each inhale connects you to those places within that may hold tension, discomfort, or unease. Each exhale invites you to release those tensions into the cosmos, bringing you to the balance place in the center of the above and the below that connects spirit and human the place between where magic happens. See yourself in a stark winter landscape. This can be a place you know in the world or a place you know in the soul. Looking across the land, your eyes take in the monochromatic template of whites and browns and grays. It is the depth of the winter and you see your beloved land stripped of brilliant color and lush foliage. Everywhere you gaze, you see skeleton silhouettes of majestic trees sprouting from a snow-covered earth. Very little is hidden in this exposed vista. That which wishes to be hidden must seek secret spots with dedication. How do you feel in the landscape of this vision? Vulnerable? Safe? Threatened? Anticipatory? You feel a pull to walk in a certain direction? A sound or a sense draws you to further explore in this place. From deep within you, you have a niggling impulse that there is something more than seemingly meets the eye. Challenge your treasure. It must be sought out and explored. In short order, you find you have come to a mountainous terrain, a sheer rock face filled with nooks, crannies and caves blocks your passage further. As you scan the rocky expanse, your eye is drawn to a glint of gold that flashes in the weak light of the newly born solstice sun. A flash of brilliance in a sea of stark. As you approach the place from which the flash emanated, you feel a cloak of trepidation drop upon your shoulders. There is something in this place that stands between you and the gold. It is no small thing. And yet, you are drawn by the enticing radiance to move closer.
as you come to the gold-filled cave and peer into the dark, the sight that fills your eyes, fills your heart with dread. You face the dragon that stands between you and the golden treasure. You realize that the only way to access the precious hoard is to find the courage to challenge this creature. That is the only way to harness the wealth of the soul that dwells in the dark cave. And it is the first necessary step along the path to wholeness that every true seeker must take. What is the energy and character of your dragon? What fearful, limiting, thwarting perspective does your dragon hold for you? What fulfilling, enriching, enlivening potential does your dragon keep you from? How do you face your dragon? Give yourself the gift of defeating or banishing your dragon, experiencing the rush of joy and the flush of success that grants you access to the treasure within the cave. And as you grasp the warm glowing gold in your hands, you see that it is not cold metal that you hold, but seeds. These small, precious golden nuggets burst with the hope of the abundant harvest of all the things to come. Things that could never be so long as they are trapped in a cold cave behind the vicious girth of an ego-driven dragon. But having access to your deep inner strength for a courageous battle and banishment, you hold these hard-won seeds in your hand and look out from the mouth of the cave, beholding the white, brown, and gray landscape and what you see across the expanse is the glorious abundance that will be. And allow yourself to take this in. 